Hey guys, this is Bryce over at Patriot Ford. It's kind of chilly today, but uh, I figured it's uh, why not show you this 2014. This is one of the 2014 expeditions that I have left. It is a uh, EL Limited, loaded with everything, guys. Uh, I haven't started up because it is kind of chilly today, so I want it to be uh, nice and toasty whenever I get inside and show you the inside. But uh, just look at this thing, guys. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's in tuxedo black metallic. Uh, it's got the body color bumpers. It's got the nice, uh, the, the Triton, the 5.4 liter Triton V8 engine. This is a four wheel drive. Uh, it does have the big 20 inch chrome clad wheels. You got your fog lamps. Um, you do have the, the front sensors there. I don't know if you can see those, but you do have the, the front parking sensors. It does have a, I'll show you the, uh, the step bars, the power deploying running boards that come out as you open the door. But I do want to go ahead and uh, walk around the outside so you can just see the entire picture here. Uh, it's got a ton of room and a whole bunch of uh, luxury features that you can come to expect on the Limited, uh, plus more. So it does have the uh, power lift gate, which is a little button on the back of here that you can push and it opens up the, uh, the rear hatch there, giving you uh, your room in the in the back uh, it is a th this is the button to close it which I'll do that here in just a second but you do have a your power folding seats there which you can fold them up and then have all of your room from the middle row back and then even the middle row even though they're buckets they do fold as well and these also you know can can come right back up just by a push of a button this is called the power fold third row seating super super nice feature um, especially if you you know you have luggage and you don't want to have to go all the way to the front seat or to the middle row and then fold the back ones down so this makes it uh, super easy uh, to do just a, a push of the button uh, right there so Let's go ahead and close this hatch. You push that button and it starts beeping at you. Say, get out of the way, um, hatch is coming down. So as you can see, it'll it'll close and latch itself and uh, you're good to go. You can also open it from the key fob or uh, there's a button on the inside, which I'll show you as well. This one does have the tow package. So you'll be able to, uh, you'll be able to pull a trailer with no problem there. Let's uh, take a look at the middle row. And as you can see, open the door and the step bars come out. Uh, so anyway, that's a, a really cool feature. This one does have the uh, perforated leather uh, buckets, second row buckets. As you can see, the in inside is uh, charcoal black. This one is equipped with the dual DVD entertainment headrests. And as you can see, you do have the, uh, there's a remote control on the console there. And then you have your headphones for either side. So. It's a really cool feature. You also have uh, rear controls for uh, all kinds of different all kinds of different stuff going on here. Rear controls for your climate settings for your rear passengers. You do have heated rear seats for your passengers back here. You do have a, a 110 volt outlet and then a 12 volt outlet there as well, and also radio settings for your back seat. So go ahead and uh, turn. Turn the heat up here, and the, you can have the fan come back here. You know, I gotta turn the controls on from the back, but once they do come on, then the controls will be active back here. So, another cool feature, say you have kiddos, you can have their temperature back here, you know, for long trips or whatever. Say you go to Colorado or wherever you may go, uh, you'll be able to, everyone in the, in the expedition will be extremely comfortable, so. Um, moving on to the front seat, you do have uh, power locks, windows, power mirrors, power folding mirrors. As you can see, both sides do that as, uh, as you pull back this joystick here. Uh, really cool feature. You have a 10-way power driver seat as well as uh, memory seats for two drivers there. Uh, the front seats are heated and cooled, whereas the middle row is heated. So as you can see, you do have your floor shifter and then your nice big console with 
your cup holders there. So let's go ahead and jump up into uh, the driver's seat so you can uh, get a get a feel of what it feels like, you know, to be behind the wheel of one of these one of these things. It's completely driver uh, oriented. It's it's that's what it's for. It's for the uh, not only for a family but also the guy that's the drive in the vehicle is going to be extremely comfortable behind the wheel. So as you can see here, you have all kinds of settings over here. You do have uh, your cruise control on the left and then all of your media and voice controls on the right. So as you can see, these are for like your media inputs like uh, Bluetooth. You'll be able to pair your phone and stream it uh, through your through the Expedition speakers. Uh, audio books, whatever, uh, whatever audio that can come out of your phone can be streamed wirelessly via Bluetooth through your uh, truck speakers. You know, so that's a really cool feature. Um, also, you can take or make a call with the uh, the hands-free button here, as well as your voice-activated settings, like uh, all kinds of different different settings. There's so many that I couldn't even begin to uh, go into. You know go into all of them you know so there's a, a ton of different voice commands that you can uh, that you can use so uh, moving on here you do have four-wheel drive uh, two high four-wheel drive automatic which is really cool uh, four high four low like you're probably used to um, as you can see I do have the uh, the map pulled up um, I do have the audio turned off that way you guys can hear me but the uh, the navigation map is pulled up you do have a uh, rear view camera with backup sensors and the dis uh, the distance lines there. Um, as you can see, I was telling you that you'll be able to open your hatch by a push of a button in the dash. That's what that is. Uh, traction control, you can turn that off. And then these are all your info buttons for your info screen. So you do have your gauges and then your info screen there that'll give you like miles to empty like it says there. Um, all kinds of different information about uh, oil temp, um, fuel mileage, all kinds of stuff comes up here that you can uh, toggle through and, and experience those those settings as well. So I did say there is a there is a tow package. It does have the trailer brake controller, as you can see there, which is uh, program programmable. Um, it does have the uh, a tow haul button as well. So whenever you're pulling a trailer, won't have any issues getting up to uh, highway speeds. So uh, last but not least, guys, I don't want to go long-winded, but there is a power moonroof, which does slide and tilt. So you'll be able to uh, enjoy the, the, the front passengers or the driver and the, and the front passenger will be able to enjoy the skylight um, while the, the rear guys can watch a movie or... Uh, whatever they need to do back there they can have they, they have entertainment back there so they have entertainment you have a moonroof and nav and ruby camera and all kinds of stuff like that so like i said guys it is driver and kind of family oriented that's uh, what the expedition was made for uh travels being comfortable that's what it that's what it is so as you can see it's got a ton of features um it does have an amazing ride to it it is uh it's got a, a leveling uh, kind of suspension, auto leveling suspension on it that gives it an even nicer ride. So anyway, uh, come check it out, guys. It's a last 14 Expedition Limited EL in tuxedo black metallic. My name is Bryce. We're at Patriot Ford here in Purcell. Just 10 minutes south of Norman, guys. Come check it out. We'd love to help you. Have a good one, guys.